Hello, welcome. I have a problem with my Volca sample. The buttons respond. Sometimes. The play button was not working when I started the video. And I was like, oh look, I'll show that it's not working. And it suddenly began working. I know the one above it, the mute button, certainly does not work. So I pressed that one to demonstrate the malfunction. Now the play button seems perfectly fine. I find this kind of frustrating. I'd like the drum machine to work all the time. So I decided to take it apart and take a good look at the button. I'm not an expert. I didn't finish college. I started going for electronics and I just kind of got distracted. Here, the white circles are what you want to look for to take that first board off. Uh, don't forget to take the knobs off like I did. Probably should do that first. This orange cable was kind of pinching the board down. Made me feel like I missed a screw, but just had to kind of wiggle it loose. Now we see white circles again on this board. Um, these screws are a different size than the second board and the back of the case. So each level has its own screw size. Uh, I found I didn't have to take off the bottom four. Here's the problem. My little tiny foil bits that I glued on uh, came loose. So sometimes they'd work and sometimes they wouldn't. And I tried to do the exact same thing, which turned out to be a mistake. Uh, but here, here's me trying again. <laughs> Uh, thinking that I had it all solved. I'm like, okay, I got it now. Let's just put it back together and I can be done. It didn't go so smoothly. Um, yeah, let's see if we can fast forward this. Bop, 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 bop. We're going to do this two more times um, today. Because <laughs> this just I ruined the surprise. I already did, but it doesn't work. Uh, the play button worked sometimes. Two more buttons stopped working. I actually had three buttons now not working. Um, it was much worse. I got a little frustrated and took a walk outside. I watched some videos online. They said, oh, take a racer to the contacts. So I tried it. They said soap and water. I tried that. Put it all back together. It didn't work. I got frustrated and took it apart again and decided to put big chunks of foil on. That's what I'm doing here. I didn't have a video of the second thing, but I ripped it apart so hard I broke the ground on the battery connection, so I had to re-solder that. Uh, yeah, I, I don't know. I love this machine. I, I love it. I just wish it'd work. I want it to be there for me. Um, this actually ended up working, uh, putting large foil across the entire piece. I'm working it back together now. I didn't even take those screws off. There's a little clear washers that I kind of lost before and I found them and put them back on But I didn't want that to happen again So I left them in there and found I could just slide the board underneath them without taking those bottom four screws off This is not the last time I'm gonna take it apart again um, I got the large pieces of foil over the buttons now going all the way across um, which solved one problem and created another. I'll show you. Um, in case you do the same thing, you'll know what to do. Okay, so I turned it on. Here we go. Buttons working great, but something's weird. They're not lighting up. I'm missing lights. All the buttons work fine, but the lights can't shine through the foil. So, good enough? No, I don't know. I had to take another look at it. No, look at it in the dark. Still can barely see the lights through the foil. So, leave it good. I know I can do better. I know I can do better. I'm going to take it apart. I'm going to do better. Uh, so, here we go. We're going to poke little holes in the foil to allow the LEDs to shine through a little bit better. But the large foil did, in fact, work. Each of the buttons were working just like day one. You push them and they react. Um, so, this is actually working. Uh, <laughs> Tiny little pieces of foil came loose and did not stay in place. These are big enough and I actually tucked them down around the corners um, and they're all super glued in. Although when I poked the holes in, it kind of wiggled them a little bit loose, but I decided just to jam it in there and see what happens. 
Uh, yeah, we're gonna put it back together as fast as we can because I know you've seen this a bunch of times. There are three different screw sizes for each level, two boards in the back. Turn it back on, they're working, they're lighting up. I'm a happy camper. Let's go make some beats, okay? <laughs> Enough of this maintenance. Um, yeah, message of Korg, yeah, these buttons are great. These devices are wonderful. I love you. I'm not even mad, but this will make it work. So for all you out there struggling, big chunk of foil, poke a hole in the middle, super glue it on. Peace and love to y'all.